Hi folks, this is all the fruit. I'm in the beautiful Saba Agricultural Park in Tenom, which you should definitely check out if you are anywhere in Borneo. For me, it's one of the best parts of the island of Borneo. And here is some dwarf ananas. The sign says ananas ananasoides or dwarf pineapple. Nanas batu in Malay. Well, what is this fruit? As the name suggests, it's a dwarf pineapple. Teeny tiny, quite pale pineapples. Well, let's see. Long spiny leaves, be careful. Close relatives of the pineapple are being used as barbed wire. And definitely walking through something like this with barefoot and in shorts will completely rip up your legs. Then, a beautiful inflorescence with red bracts and beautiful blue flowers. Very similar to normal pineapple. Then the fruit of the inflorescence are ripening. Well, there is another branch growing out of the inflorescence. The ananas fruit or pineapple fruit is actually a whole inflorescence with fruit grown together. And actually this branch tip here and this branch tip here, you could plant both and get two new pineapple plants. Well, once the pineapple is dead and rotting, here you can see the, this branch is continuing to grow. Same with this. You could take this one and plant it somewhere in the ground and you would get a new pineapple plant. Here another one. The, the fruit cluster, which looks like one single fruit, is rotting, but the branch tip is growing. Hmm. Now the interesting question is, what does this pineapple taste? Okay, I don't want to destroy one of the beautiful ones. So let's try one which is almost starting to rot. Oops, it came off very easily. So I guess it's really ripe. Let's remove the tip. Yeah, well, I could plant this in the ground and would, with some luck, get another pineapple fruit. So here we have this pineapple fruit. It's definitely ripe. Does not have the slightly reddish color of the underripe ones or the white color of the well-developed ones, but, oh God, there's a cloud of mosquitoes around me, even here where there is a lot of sun, but it's already turning brownish. It smells pretty much like pineapple, not as good as um, normal ananas comoso, so the commercially available pineapple, but uh, get away from me, but good enough. Let's get in the sun. Mosquitoes don't like the sun, but I'm afraid that those here will Attack me even in the sun. Off. Oh, Actually, most of them left. Good. Uh, most of them left, but a couple are still circling around me. Well, now, ah, uh, stop biting me. Oh, now they're in my shade. Well, now since I'm in the sun, I cannot see almost anything, but okay, let's try this fruit. Mm. Tastes like pineapple. Mm. Ah, let me get a little bit too much to watch the shape. Tastes like pineapple. Not as nice as some commercially available ananas comosos. It's sweet. There is no sourness, but enough sweetness. The pineapple flavor. It's not overwhelming, but definitely there. Here you can see a couple seeds. Yeah, on my thumbnail. Yeah. Definitely a good pineapple. Definitely completely right. No trace of sourness, but the sweetness is not that incredible. And the ananas flavor is... Less than that of a good ananas comosus, but still definitely good enough. So folks, this was the dwarf pineapple, ananas ananasoides. A not so bad tiny little pineapple. Stay tuned for a lot more fruit videos from the beautiful island of Borneo and the beautiful 
Tenham Agricultural Park. And don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe.